Hi, I am in my sunroom and today we're going to play with some Wandering Dude Plant. That's the way I like to say it. So we're going to take some cuttings from this. We're going to put the cuttings in water and we're going to put some cuttings in soil and we're going to see which ones do better. I have this beautiful tri-colored Wandering Dude Plant. I'll put the other the Latin name on the screen. Here's a closer look at this beautiful plant. One of the easiest things to root. I had little tiny cuttings and I put them all in this pot and now they're really long and beautiful. So like I said earlier, we're gonna take some cuttings and put them in water. And we're gonna take some cuttings and put them in a pot. Hi, welcome back. I wanna show you how easy it is to root these wandering dude plants. So all you do is you take a cutting and you come and you clip a little piece off right under a leaf node and you just cut it. And then you take the entire piece and you put it in water. This one has been rooting since March 22nd and today is April 3rd. So it's got tons of roots in here. Let me show you one of these. One of the easiest things to root. See the roots that came out of it right there? But honestly, these plants, you don't even need to root in water. You can just root right in soil. That's what I did right here. Look how tiny this is. Come on in. See how tiny these little plants are? And they're nice and rooted. I did those on, I have a tag here. February 24th and they're nice and rooted if I pull actually might as well just take it out and show you see it's a pull it's a full plant can you get in there nice and rooted super easy these plants are very easy and they're beautiful so they're either they're either a house plant or you can put them out in a pot during the summer. These guys like to be outside in the warm or inside. So my daughter Kim painted a really cute pot and I'm gonna show her how to pot up a plant. So come along. Hi, this is my daughter Kim. I'm gonna show her how to plant up a wandering dude. If you look at this darling pot, she painted it. It kind of looks like a pineapple to me. I really love it. It's quite darling. We have these tri Truscantia plants, or Wandering Dude, Wandering Jew is another way to say it. These two have rooted. So all you would do is stick them right in. And this one that Kim is holding has not rooted. But I'm gonna show you how easy it is without roots just to stick it in. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna use our hand as a dibbler or a spot to make a hole. So put your finger, we're gonna do three. So we're gonna do one, two, three, kind of like a triangle. And you kind of want them along the sides because they root a little better along the sides of a pot. And then you have the one that has no root. Should I take these leaves off? You can, you can actually plant this baby. Do you want to plant that baby? Yeah. <laughs> so put it right in the pot, stick it all the way in there. Show dad so that he can see what you're doing. Thank stick you. it all the way in the pot and then fill it back in. And then do the one with the root. You can take off this one leaf and get all the way in there. Get it pretty. I would bury it to there. I don't know how to shove it in there. But you could kind of push it all the way in. I want it to snap. Okay. Um. What climate is best for these flowers? They have uh, to be. It's an indoor plant, or you can use it as an annual. I think that it's probably zones nine and higher. So it's kind of a tropical. But plant it for me because I don't really know. That's fine. Those terms. So it needs to be. It loves the sun. It needs to be warm. Okay. I was gonna put it in my windowsill. But I think downstairs. it will work downstairs in your windowsill because it's also used as a house plant. It's not as much the light as it is the warmth. And I put it in this hole, right? Yeah. Get Should I get in. more soil? It, it is your plant. It's one of the easiest plants. You're going to love it. 
and you just kind of turn it the way you want it to go. And then, don't forget the little baby. Just put him right, right here. Okay, get in here and show the baby. Do you want this lamp? Can we break this one off? Sure. And we take that off. My limbs. <laughs> and then see that little baby. Show the baby. See the little baby. Oh, I'm so proud, Kim. Good job. She wanted to have a plant herself in her own room. So we're just gonna let it sit here and drain out all the moisture. And then you can put it on its own plate. It has a nice big hole that it's getting all this water coming out. Um, and then you should, I use. We can, we'll talk about that. Or a lid. Okay. Or even a lid, something that will hold the moisture. And you're not gonna water these. They're, they're a house plant, they're inside. You're not gonna water them like maybe once every week or every two weeks. Probably two weeks because I'll probably forget a lot. Yeah. I'm so proud of you, Kim. Kim potted up her first plant in a pot that she painted. It was just spray I'll paint. Tongue twister. <laughs> the Kim pot potted oh. in her first. Say it. <laughs> <laughs> Kim potted her first plant. No, I messed Kim up. Kim potted her first plant. Tunia. She potted and, and painted the petunia. Painted pink. with a petunia, a pink petunia in a pot that she painted. Oh, <laughs> have fun you with bye. It. Have fun with it.